Hello, and welcome to our guide to the Tulane University Health Insurance Requirements. Tulane University requires degree-seeking students and students in J-1 status to demonstrate enrollment and maintain adequate quality medical insurance. This requirement applies to degree-seeking dissertation students and research assistants, and degree-seeking students who may live off campus, participate in out-of-town internships, or study abroad during the academic year. This requirement does not apply to school or professional advancement students or distance learning students, although those students can optionally sign up for the Tulane-sponsored Student Health Insurance Plan. For a list of the university standards, please visit our website. Students must use the online insurance tools to take action by the posted deadlines, which can be found at our website. Students may choose to either enroll in the Tulane-sponsored Student Health Insurance Plan, T-SHIP, or opt out of T-SHIP by receiving an approved waiver after demonstrating that their existing insurance plan meets or exceeds the university standards. Students must complete this process at the beginning of every academic year that they are at Tulane. It is critical to monitor your Tulane email account for notifications and reminders from United Healthcare and Gallagher Student Health and Special Risk. T-SHIP is provided through United Healthcare Student Resources. To enroll, students must request coverage online through the United Healthcare Student Resources website. The email from United Healthcare will provide instructions and links to request coverage. Tulane has contracted with Gallagher Student Health and Special Risk to verify health insurance coverage and issue approvals for T-SHIP waiver requests. You must submit information about your health insurance coverage online to Gallagher. The email from Gallagher will provide instructions for that process. Degree-seeking international students are required to enroll in T-SHIP. Non-degree-seeking international students in J-1 status must enroll in either T-SHIP or an alternate plan from GeoBlue. Exemptions to this requirement are granted on a case-by-case -case basis when international students are covered by a U.S.-based group health insurance plan. More information about how to request an exemption can be found on the Campus Health website. If a student does not enroll in T-SHIP or receive an approved waiver to opt out of T-SHIP by the deadline, the university will automatically enroll the student in T-SHIP for the academic year. The student will be charged for the insurance premium on their student account. Students are strongly encouraged to take action well before the deadline to avoid being charged for unwanted coverage. The Tulane sponsored student health insurance plan is provided by United Healthcare Student Resources. This plan meets all of the university standards. When a student enrolls in T-SHIP, the premium will be charged to the student's account, and then the university directly pays the premium to United Healthcare. T-SHIP covers most medical services offered in this health center and offers low co-pays for prescriptions in the campus health pharmacy. Coverage includes the following, pre-existing conditions, mental health services, laboratory services, unlimited annual maximum benefit, prescription benefits with low co-pays, and it also provides coverage 24 hours per day worldwide. Students who decide to opt out of T-SHIP must submit their information about their insurance coverage through Gallagher Student Health and Special Risk online verification portal. Before submitting this information, please review the full list of university standards for adequate insurance. It may be also helpful to compare your current benefits to T-SHIP using the T-SHIP benefits comparison chart. To learn more about how to opt out of T-SHIP, please visit our website. Most students in T-SHIP are automatically assessed the campus health fee and are required to obtain a referral from the health center before receiving outside medical care. 
but some categories of students are not assessed the campus health fee and are therefore do not have this requirement. Students falling into these categories include some research, dissertation, and teaching students who are generally free to seek community providers without a referral. It's important to know what category you fall in before seeking care in the community. If you are unsure about what category you're in, please reach out to our insurance team for guidance. Please pay special attention if one of the following scenarios applies to you. If you are initially assessed the campus health fee in the fall, but is later removed due to a change in registration. If you are assessed the campus health fee in the fall, but you are not assessed the fee in the spring due to a change in your student status. If you have any questions about the student health insurance requirement, our insurance enrollment team is ready to help. You may reach out to our staff by logging on to our health insurance webpage and using our Let's Talk chat application. Thank you very much for your time.